March 24, Paige Buecher scored 20 points to end the Syracuse University women's basketball season and lead top-seeded Connecticut into the Sweet 16 on Tuesday night. The freshman AP All-American point guard led three players in double figures and the Huskies rolled to an 83-47 victory over the eighth-seeded Orange in the NCAA Tournament Riverwalk region's second-round matchup at the Alamodome in San Antonio, Texas. Camila Cardozo and Emily Engstler scored 12 points apiece for Syracuse, 15-9, which reached the NCAA second round for the sixth time in seven years but finished one game shy of making their second Sweet 16. When you come into these games and you have opportunities against great teams, you got to find a way to get your team to respond and I didn't get my team ready to respond today," Sioux coach Quentin Hilsman said. You've got to be able to compete at a high level against the best in the country if you want to be there. Aliyah Edwards and Olivia Nelson Ododa added 19 and 17 points, respectively, to help UConn, 26-1, win its 26th straight in the series with Sioux, including three tournament games in the last five years. The Huskies advanced despite the absence of Hall of Fame coach, Gino Orima, who has yet to appear in the tourney due to a positive COVID-19 test. UConn improved to 11-0 all-time under associate head coach Chris Daly, but Orima is expected back for next weekend's Sweet 16 matchup against No. 5 Iowa, 20-9. Buker scored 16 in the first half and logged a single field goal attempt afterward, connecting on all nine of her foul shots in the game. UConn made 24 of 30 free throws overall. She sparked a 23-7 run that spanned from late in the second to the middle of the third quarter to help the Huskies pull away. They held a 41-26 advantage at halftime and outscored Sue, 23-9, in the third quarter to push the game out of reach. Syracuse shot just 28% from the field and went 3-for-15 from long range in its lowest scoring output of the season. Tiana Mangakahia finished with 7 points and 3 assists across 37 minutes in her final game for the Orange. The fifth-year senior from Brisbane, Australia, entered the game as the national leader in assists average, 7.5, during her comeback from stage 2 breast cancer this year and has the highest career total among active players, 736. I just couldn't believe that I was finished playing at Syracuse, Mangakahia said of her thoughts walking off the court. I was just thinking of everything that everyone has done for me at Q's. It just sucked not being able to beat them and move forward. Mangakahia leaves Sue as the all-time program leader in assists and tallied 1,341 career points. Digna Stroutman and Kiara Lewis are also senior starters but have yet to announce their intentions for next season. Hilsman took off his signature flashy glasses and started to cry when asked about Mangakahia's final game calling her the toughest player he has ever coached.